Uh, nothing. Here I was thinking something was gonna jump me. Ah, oh, I remember this. I think. I think the water is not safe. Those wires into the water. Do you think it's safe to cross? I think I died in the water once. Uh, but that's so many years ago, I'm not completely sure. I don't want to find out. So... Let's just see if we can get on top of the pipes and not get wet. Not sure Lana is gonna follow. But that's her prerogative. If she wanna have a bath, she can go right ahead. <laughs> I know I had to cross, but when I think about it, I'm not so sure I did this like this. What are you? An irresistible object is what it is. Hazardous material? Not anymore. Well, not if I hold my breath. Yeah, we're supposed to get to a computer? Not that one. Wait, Lana? Lana! Are you okay? Take a breath. <laughs> She's okay. Now I feel overly cautious. Ah, uh, <laughs> yep, yep, yep. Pretty lights, just for me. Now I'm definitely using these. What did I, in fact, do? I hit that. Thing it exploded sort of and or at least it overloaded something made some pretty lights that probably means I was safe to cross it <laughs> earlier fine so I didn't want to get wet okay Uh, security officer's ID badge. Probably gonna come in handy somewhere. Wasn't there a security area downstairs? It probably was. And of course I can't enter. Half of these doors are still locked. This feels even more deserted than the rest of the ship for some reason. something over there. I'll check it out in a bit. I feel like this ship has become part of the asteroids now. Drifting for eons in dead silence. I would love to experience space. You know? I've thought about that. Would you actually feel like you're outside at all because there's no wind no sound i don't know but chris hatfield once said he opened the hatch and there he was looking at the rest of the universe i thought that was so beautiful subject gamma 19 hibernation protocol failing containment fields inactive do not restore power before reactivating containment fields. Subject Gamma 
is classified orange 12 on the Yixbon scale. Never heard of that before. Containment field controls located at main research station terminal. So, back downstairs again. Can we finally open this door? Something's happened here. Whoa! What? Lana? Lana? Um... Oh, that's... that's the... It said something about the air being thin, but we... we know that. We've got time. Plenty of time. The quarters are not that small. There's supposed to be some crates, something that can help me, right? But I can't find them anywhere. Why can't I check the bodies? Oh, it's dark. I can't. I can't read the the text, of course. So, <laughs> where? I have no idea. It it's so dark. And Lana's eyes. I think I saw Lana's eyes. It's just disturbing. I didn't think her eyes would light up in the dark. And I don't know if I'm pointing upwards or down or whatever when I'm turning around. Yeah, it's becoming noticeably thinner. The air, I mean. So. What are we looking for? The door. Come on. Please open. Please. <laughs> Let me out! It's becoming difficult to breathe. No! I shouldn't have talked about you being a widow. Uh, please forgive me. <laughs> please. There you are. My lovely wife. This is how it's gonna end. Now I'm stuck too. I can't move. Everything's shaking. So? <laughs> I guess... I don't know what I'm looking for. I know a way to get out of here and I think I need to do that because now I can't... I can't move. So... Slash stuck. No. Try again. <laughs> Ah, oh, I should have known. Now, let's not be hasty. Have a look, Lana. Help me figure out if you see something. I can. Something by a wall, right? An opening, some vents, something that we can break into? Unfortunately, I can't find a thing that looks like it's clickable, so... <laughs> Let's see what the quest says. Wait, are you kidding me? <laughs> Seriously? I had the freaking lights with me from the start. I... Yeah, now it makes sense why this light activated every time I was supposed to read a journal. I had it with me the whole time. <laughs> That's what I get for hiding so much on my screen. Um, I... Remove the control fuse. So I'm supposed to find a new one in here. Where though? Here it is. In the junk pile. Of course. 
a fuse sized metal object. Yeah, we're, we're just gonna test it out. What could go wrong, right? <laughs> Should feel better now. Good thing the force protects me. Nope. No lights. I guess the creepy parts are sort of over. Dern, we know you've been hoarding. That's why we let you think we store our food in here. It's too late, though. You're trapped. We're headed to the labs to get what's ours. Your people can't stop us. Hope these are your last thoughts before the air runs out. Nice. So they set up, he and someone else set up this trap for these at least four people. Medical officers, ID badge. Then we know where to go. Uh, n not the direction, but... <laughs> Here we are. Medical bay. Someone's broken out, but... Okay. What else is happening here? Other than an, another log. Autopsy on researcher Orglo. Gamma 19 didn't even leave Marrow behind. Oh. Management needs to start hiring staff with common sense. The line on the floor says do not cross for a reason. Uh oh. I didn't realize I had stopped recording. I picked up one of these empty steam injectors. And then I filled it with nylite from one of these canisters. A steam injector filled with a concentrated nylite solution. Extremely... Extremely toxic to most life forms. Wow, I I never noticed this one. Oh, I talked about something breaking out. Here we go. Did you even fit in that Bakta tank? It sure can scream. It's not that good at... Never mind. Can I use this thing on you? Let's see what it does. Come on. Did it do anything? Yeah, 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 yeah. Now it's mad. <laughs> I can't hear a thing. <laughs> yeah, we we both fell. <sighs> I guess the schematics are on this thing, right? Come on. Yeah, do a couple of times more. Kick it. <laughs> hey, 
HK glasses as in Droid model 51 schematics transferred. Have a profitable day. Right, thanks. Profitable. Depends on how you look at it. We're done. Ah, that was fun. Now we have the schematics. We know which parts were missing. I would think every part, but oh well, the chassis is standing in the freezer, so. Let's see what our journal says. Uh, first five of the required components can be found on the surface of particular planets. Recovery of the components will likely require use of a Burma, uh, a Burba seismic excavator scanner. The first component, an HK primary transistor, can be found in the Outlaw Den area on Tatooine. I've decided to do the thing I hate the most first, and then we'll do the things that are slightly less hated. <laughs> Uh, because that's um, luck of the draw, how quickly I'll get the rest of them. And the reason I hate this is because it's a PvP area. And my hope is that people are sort of tired of the outlaws then doing other stuff. So I won't be attacked by a mob of... Jedi or scary smugglers <laughs> I mean I, I remember the first time I was here it was kind of stressful because back then the game was new and everyone was about to get their HK droid and this area was teeming with people. Am I going the right way? I hate getting attacked by other people because most other fights I can avoid if I want to. But in a PvP area, it's not up to me. Actually, I don't hate all PvP. I've been in spontaneous battles and had so much fun and also I've been in a few matches but that's years ago and the difference is here I'm all alone and if someone decides to jump me and it would be a one-on-one -on -one fight then fine but it's hardly that way when you're in an area like this at least that's my experience from some other games and random PvP encounters so, I get the thrill. I get that people think it's exciting. I might be exaggerating when I say I hate PvP. Just an uneasy feeling coming here alone. Right, one of these. And... And this one. Let's get out of this area. The next we're getting is uh, on Taris, near the wreck of the Endar Spire. We're looking for the the chassis? Wait. <laughs> they can't be right. I mean, fine, it says so, but the chassis is standing frozen, waiting for me on hot. I'm building my own HK unit. Actually, let's go to Drum and Cars first, because it's two button clicks away. And, since we're here, I'd like to show you around. At least, parts of it. I'll, I'll be quick, I promise. This is my new hobby, decorating with these trophy pictures. I might have gone a bit overboard, but <laughs> there's so few items to hang on the wall that are not as big as the banners, so... Yeah. 
Here's my beauty area with my quote-unquote mirror. But of course, there's nothing to change here. Move along. This is not Seance home, but she's allowed to come visit whenever she wants. <laughs> I don't know who sleeps here either, but someone has got company or guests. Now on to the funnest part of this stronghold. I want to sing a song for you all. Good thing it's not my voice. Ends very abruptly, I know. Sorry, it's not it's not me, okay? <laughs> Look, I've got some new moves. No no, come on. Is this more to your liking? No? How about this? Still? Look at him. He's digging the music. The music I'll have to pretend is there and edit in afterwards. So back to the temple we go. First scan. I'll try and count them, but I'm afraid it's going to be a lot of them. Now I need to find these parts in the ground. This is probably going to take a while. I don't remember how many times I did this last time, but I've counted 20 this far. And 47, I think. And we're getting close. 25 meters? Probably right where they were standing. It, it always is. Let's see what it says now. Not two meters. Five meters, all right. Which way? This way, let's try. This is something you can do with a group of people. Hello. You can go and collect from whatever someone else has found. This yellow beam is going to stand there for a while. Next time, we're going to Terrace, Coruscant, and Hoth. And hopefully, we'll get to start a flashpoint, an exciting part of the story. In the meantime, take care. Until next time. <laughs>